solo success is a myth, and Navy SEALs know something that the rest of us often forget. Their toughest training reveals the surprising power of helping others and how it unlocks your own potential. This lesson isn't just about survival, it's the key to thriving. Hi, I'm Matt Riley, and here at Learn Something New, we turn the ordinary into extraordinary by covering a wide range of topics. My passion is for understanding how people achieve success, and this passion led me to Simon Sinek, a well-known thought leader in leadership and motivation. His ideas resonated deeply, so I spent over 27 hours not just reading his books, but digging into the underlying methodologies. I earned my bachelor's degree in sociology, the study of how people behave in groups and societies. The topic has always fascinated me, and that's the lens that helps me connect Simon Sinek's concepts to real-world situations. Simon Sinek asked the question, why? Why do people and companies do what they do? Now, this question is powerful because it gets to the heart of what truly motivates us. It's the question that looks at who we are being versus what we are doing. And after all, we are human beings, not human doings. Simon Sinek has powerful life lessons that can help us grow as individuals, which in turn helps us improve everything that we do. So I'll be breaking them down into a five-part video series to empower you to achieve your own success. Building on the previous lessons about breaking the rules and taking accountability, we're tackling the third lesson today that changed my life taking care of each other, a concept that the world's toughest warriors understand. The United States Navy SEALs are perhaps the most elite warriors in the world. One of the SEALs was asked, who makes it through the selection process and who's able to become a SEAL? His answer was, I can't tell you the kind of person that becomes a SEAL. I can't tell you the kind of person that makes it through Hell Week and Buds, but I can tell you the kind of people who don't become SEALs. He says the guys that show up with their huge bulging muscles covered in tattoos who want to prove to the world how tough they are, none of them make it through. He said that the leaders who like to delegate all of the responsibility responsibility and never do anything themselves, none of them make it through. He said that the all-star college athletes who never really had been tested to the core of their being, none of them make it through. He says some of the guys that make it through are skinny and scrawny. Some of the guys that make it through, you'll see them shivering and trembling out of fear. He says, however, all the people that make it through, when they find themselves physically spent and emotionally spent, when they have nothing left to give physically, emotionally, or mentally, somehow, some way, they're able to find energy to dig down deep inside themselves, to find the ability to help the guy and the person next to them. They become SEALs. He said, you want to be an elite warrior? It's not about how tough you are. It's not about how smart you are. It's not about how fast you are. If you want to be an elite warrior, you better get really, really good at helping the person to the left of you and helping the person to the right of you. Because that's how people advance in this world. The world is too dangerous and too difficult for you to think you can do these things alone. If you find your spark, I commend you. Now, who are you going to ask for help? And when are you going to accept help when it's offered? Learn that skill. Learn by practicing helping each other. It's the single most valuable thing you'll ever learn in your entire life, to accept help when it's offered and to ask for it when you know you can't do it. The amazing thing is, when you learn to ask for help, you'll discover that there are people all around you who have always wanted to help you. They just didn't think you needed it because you kept pretending that you had everything under control. And the minute you say, I don't know what I'm doing, I'm stuck, I'm scared, I don't think I can do this. You will find that lots of people who love you will rush in and take care of you. But that'll only happen if you learn to take care of them first. Summary. The Navy SEAL story reveals a profound truth. The greatest strength lies not in our individual abilities, but in our capacity to support and uplift others. Whether striving for personal goals or building a successful team or navigating challenges, true progress is fulfilled by the spirit of cooperation. It's in helping each other that we become the best versions of ourselves. Conclusion. Our individual paths to success are intertwined with those around us, and when we embrace the responsibility and joy of lifting others, we not only unlock their potential, but we also unlock ours. Ask yourself, 
Who in your life needs your support? How can you foster a community where everyone feels empowered to offer help? Remember, the journey to extraordinary begins with recognizing that we're all stronger together. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and click the notification bell to be alerted when the next life-changing lesson is ready. Check the description for more resources and remember by using the Amazon affiliate links in the description below, it supports this channel and helps me make more videos like this possible. See you in the next video when we uncover the next life lesson for being successful because together we can achieve the extraordinary. Thank you very much.